going to see the demo for book php web application now let's see how to start the project first open the xamp control panel start the mysql database and apache web server next open the visual studio code and then explore the folder and then click the readme text here you can see the project url and then login details copy the localhost php my admin and paste to the browser left side you can able to view the backend database tables Click the table name, you can view the data. For Windows user, open the XAMPP control panel, start the Apache and MySQL. Then click the MySQL admin, it will promote you to the web browser. Then you can view the backend database table. Next, open the Visual Studio code. Explore the web folder. Here you can see the project delivery files. Explore the JS, you can view the Angular JS files. Click the file name, then you can view the source code. And then click the HTML file, you can view the HTML source code. And then click the readme text, copy the project URL and paste to the browser. Here we have single role that is user only. Before you log in, you have to register. Click the user registration. Here you can enter all the fields for user registration. Enter the name, email ID, and then enter the password, mobile number. And then enter the address. And then enter the answers once you do that click the register button the password must be in eight digit it must contain one capital letter one special character and numbers the registered successfully then login the user Enter the email ID and password, then click the login button. So, login successful. Here we have several models. Here you can creating a book and then view the book details and then search the books. Here you can view the borrowed book details and then post your feedback and then view the feedback and then view the profile details. Let's start with a create book. Click the create book. Here you can enter all the fields for add a book. Enter the book name, and then enter the author name, and then enter the description. And then enter the language. And enter the publisher and enter the address and then enter the email ID and mobile number Once you do that, click the submit button. So created successfully. Whatever has been created, you can view here. If you want to update any details, you can do it here.
and then click the update map here you can manually update the location just to drag and drop the red bubble where the location you want to update and then click the update geo it will capture the latitude and longitude of the google map here you can using the search option then click the search book here you can view the many book details and then click the feedback here you can enter the name and then feedback then click the submit button the feedback will be posted enter the name and then enter the feedback then click the comments here you can post your comments and then click the email here you can enter the from address and to address and then enter the email content once you do that click the send button it will be sent and then click the geo map here you can view the location and then click the borrow if you want to borrow the book you can enter the date here you can select the up to date that means when you return the book once you selected click the submit button it will be created and then click the user request here you can view the borrowed book details and then here you can update the status whether it is binding lending or borrowed then click the my borrow here you can view your borrowed book details and then click the view feedback here you can view the feedback and then click my profile here you can view the profile details if you want to update anything you can do it here so this is a book php web application Shopping.